Good morning! Today is the last day that the packing company is packing up our house. We're leaving in around like 45 minutes uh, for good, which is so sad. It's just so weird to see this house completely empty after living in it for four years. I don't know, it's just weird. Most of my bags are already packed. Here are my bags. I just have to pack Stella's stuff. Where's... Ah. We're going to Nuremberg for a few days just to figure some things out. Uh, Mariana is gonna be there with her parents and her brother. Uh, so that'll be really fun to see them again. And then this weekend I'm going to France because it's been a bit under a year since I've seen any of my French family. Um, and France made it into the World Cup Finals, so we're gonna watch the uh, final all together, which is really exciting. My voice is kind of raspy right now. <clears throat> I woke up with a bit of a sore throat, but that's okay. I don't want to be dramatic. Oh yeah, I have a hole in my shirt right here. Um, because Stella scratched me. <laughs> She's so cute. Ow! We're gonna go have lunch. <laughs> uh, we're gonna try to go to a really good cafe called Oleander. I love it so much. I rave about it. I, I just, I think it's so cute. I'll show you guys inside. It is just like the most beautiful place ever. Gorgeous, this place is. Oh, it's so pretty. Wait, so are you excited to move or not? No, not really. Why? I'm not the type of person that wants to like leave, like where my home is. I, I feel like I need somewhere to stay. So we just got our mint lemonades. What do you think? Good. Good? Let's see if I like it. Mm. I like it. Uh, I'll keep you posted. <laughs> I'll keep you posted. This vlogging dies. Ah. I am a pro. Okay. Um, I like Our food it. came and look at how good this looks. <laughs> Yummy. We just finished everything. If you if you record, are we gonna record too? Or, 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 this is a rivalry. A rivalry. We just finished everything. We're so full, but it was so good. I don't know what he's doing. I just got back home, and I thought I'd give you guys a little haul of what I bought. Yeah, I can't read that through the viewfinder. Wilkinson sword. Three plus one free. How amazing is that? I bought this toothpaste. Signal. I'm usually a Colgate type of gal, but this was the cheapest one there and there was no Colgate. And then I bought this Listerine, Listerine Zero. Never tried this. I'm a fan of the purple or like the lilac one. I don't really know what it's called. Um, or like the really uh, like dark turquoise one. Uh, I love the way it like burns your mouth. I know it's like a very weird thing to like, but yeah, never tried it. I hope I like it. Well, I have a little problem. Not a problem so much as a not a problem. So we were planning on leaving at 12 in the afternoon right after having lunch. So my brother and I just went for lunch, went to the Tesco to buy some stuff, came back, um, and turns out my mom has a meeting, or several meetings until seven, so we're actually not leaving until um, seven or 6.30, I can't remember. I thought that this is a problem, but we literally have nothing in our house right now. Wi-Fi, couch, TV, games, paper. But there's nothing other than what is in my bag, um, which is like toiletries, makeup, retainers, and a pencil case. <laughs> so this is our kitchen. Super echoey. There's my cat. This before, this was such a crowded room. Um, and now it's so empty. This is where my piano was. That's just so weird. Yeah, I don't really know what to do for like seven hours, but... I'll figure something out. All right, so it's about an hour later and I am still bored. So I just thought I'd do a fun, basic, what's in my toiletry bag? <laughs> Sorry, this is super annoying. I'm gonna have to tilt a little bit, but I'm just gonna try to... And as you guys know, I bought Listerine and I bought toothpaste and I bought razors. So I do kind of have to clean out my toiletry bag. So I just thought, you know what? Might as well film it, get some 
I was gonna say quality content, but this is my toiletry bag. I got it um, in Morocco somewhere. <laughs> Look at that. Oh well, cat life, right? I have this moisturizer that I'm gonna throw away because it's it's finished. Uh, I don't know why I still have that. Nasty. Got this toothbrush. Oh my gosh. Sorry guys, I'm trying so hard. I know a lot of people like hard toothbrushes or hard bristles, I don't know. So it really scrubs, but I'm a soft bristle kind of person. I really like when my gums don't bleed. This is another toothpaste I have, uh, or another, I didn't even say the first one. This is the first one. I don't know if toothpaste can expire, but this is, I'm not even kidding, solid. This is another toothpaste. I think I actually stole this from um, my cousin Mariana's mom. Look at how nasty that is, yeah. It's really gross. Everything is kind of solid-y. I don't like the, nah, whatever. I have four hair ties, two springy ones and two uh, like classic elastic ones, depending on the day. Is that butter? I don't know. You know what, we're just gonna have to. This is the toner I have from Garnier. For anyone that has acne, this has changed my life. Obviously, I still do have acne, but it's much, much better since I've used this toner. Uh, this is my old Listerine that I finished. I literally have like two drops in there. Okay, this is the moisturizer I use. Um, I only recently started using this moisturizer. I started using it in the beginning of the summer, but it has changed my life. It is the L'Oreal Paris uh, Revitalift, I don't I don't know. This is the only moisturizer that I've used that I think uh, like it, it the thickness is perfect. It moisturizes your skin but doesn't you know make you break out. It is just this is a staple. Okay, then I have my tongue scraper. This is a lifesaver. I, I don't know why people don't use tongue scrapers. I can't go to sleep unless I use my tongue scraper. I can't go to school unless I use my tongue scraper. This is just a staple item for me. Here's the thing. If I were on a deserted island and I could only bring three things, I'd bring a boat, the captain of a boat, and this bad boy. I have a bell band-aid, because you never know when you're gonna need a band-aid. I have this um, Carmex lip balm that like, is my life. I don't want to sound basic and be like, oh my god, like, Carmex. I breathe and live Carmex, but I breathe and live Carmex. That's it. That's all. Whoa, my cat just jumped onto the table and she really scared me. We still have around two hours until our mom's meetings uh, finish. So we're just walking to another supermarket called Albert. Um, to get donuts and Oreos and Coca-Cola. We're walking on this little sidewalk, just for memory's sake. Our dog died whilst we were in Prague, maybe two years ago, uh, in 2016, and we used to lift her up and put her on this little ledge, I don't know. In my new school, we go on grade trips, and the entirety of 11th grade will be going to Croatia to do a bunch of like outward bound activities. And a lot of outward bound activities include heights and walking literally on the edge of a mountain. <laughs> I'm a little nervous. I'm gonna miss this park so much. <laughs> what the? So we got some snacks. Oh my, I got ice cream, donut, iced tea, strawberry yogurt drink. I don't know what this is. I just think it tastes so good and a white chocolate magnum, because how could you not? Last ice cream in Prague, how do you feel? Cold. We're going home now, hopefully we can leave soon, because we've literally just been wandering around our neighborhood and house for 